Hello again everyone, as usual, I'm BuffBud, and today we are back with another episode of Final Fantasy X. Now, last episode, we checked out the last bits of the Thunder Plains, because, uh, the, uh, weird cactar ghost mirror thing that we had going on there, uh, that we made our way over into the Makalania Woods here. Uh, now, I said I was gonna try to, um... Uh, to do some work off camera to be able to uh, grind up some levels but I also said that I'm not sure if I'll be able to do much because Pokemon Sword and Shield was coming out the day that this video uh, that last video came out and um, yeah I, I I've really not been doing any work on this game at all in fact I haven't even taken Pokemon Sword out of my uh, switch until basically right before I had to record this video, so, uh, yeah. Sorry. But anyway, um, let, let's hope we don't have any, uh, big battles that we have to deal with, because that's gonna suck. Uh, in the meantime, yeah, let's, uh, let's continue. We do have a Waka here. Welcome. Does he- Holiday prices on all items in celebration of nice to see- Oh my god. So yeah, he doesn't ask, uh, for, uh, ask for any more money. That's kind of weird. I kind of want to look to see, uh, like, Google what would happen if you were to give him a lot of money versus no money at all. I'm really curious as to what the difference there is. Anyway. Let's see if he has any good weapons. Um, eh, it doesn't really seem good. Nah. Nah. I'm pretty sure we are... Yeah, that's the exact same one that we have. Uh, no. No. And no. Okay. Too expensive, you think? No. Um, let's just say just right. Okay. Speaking of which, um, I feel like we didn't actually equip some of them. Okay, no. You got yours. Orin. Oh, I can just do that. Okay. Yeah, you got yours. Armor. Okay, yeah, that's better. You. Yep, you have yours. Oh wow, you have a lot. Why do you have so many? You have the metal shield. Um. Yeah, okay. Okay, so that gives you magic, magic, sensor. Okay. Right now you have Silence Ward, which is actually pretty good for her, because she does need to use her magic in order to heal. Okay. Let's see, you have the Switch Hitter currently out, so Strength and Strength. Hmm. Weird. Okay. I also don't remember how to customize these things. I think there's an option... Yeah, customize. Okay. So right now you have magic, strength, and piercing. Does he really need magic? I feel like I can give him this one, and then customize it with like more strength or something like that. I think for the time being, we're gonna leave him with this one, but we're gonna keep this one in the back of our mind. It's not a bad idea. Wait, it is here, somewhere. Oh? What's here? Something you should see. But, Sir Oren... It won't take long. Holy crud. He's just cutting straight through those, um, crystal log things. Dang, Orin, you a beast. Oh, and we can keep going now, okay. By the way, I do apologize if you guys hear Grim uh, meowing constantly. It is about uh, 40 minutes before I'm supposed to feed him, so naturally, 
I am uh, neglecting him, and I am uh, uh, forgetting to feed him, so he's, he's probably going to be meowing a lot. So, yeah. And what do we have here? Looks like a pretty tree and all, but... This place... It's just water, isn't it? This is what spheres are made of. It absorbs and preserves people's memories. What's that? Oh, come on! I said no battles! Are also attracted to these places. God dang it. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Okay, so first things first, I wanna steal. Not really helpful. Okay, immune to sensors. Interesting. Um. Next time it gets to Riku's turn, I think we're gonna switch over to um, Lulu because I feel like this thing has gotta be some sort of water-based um, fiend. Okay, Grim, you are really causing trouble now. I cannot hear anything. There we go. He was laying on the. Uh, uh, the part where my headphones uh, adapt to my TV. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, uh, I think we should switch to Lulu because this thing seems like it's probably water based. So, um, thunder magic would probably be good against it. In the meantime, I only have haste and cheer. Or I could just straight up attack it. Let's straight up attack it for now and see what we can do. Well, what skills do we got? Delay attack and extract speed. Um. Nah, let's just attack. That gave it 49 extra health. Huh. Okay. Can you do any damage? Okay, Orin can do damage. <clears throat> Titus cannot do any damage at all. Uh, Lulu, get on out here. Okay, so we're gonna try Thunder. Didn't we get an upgraded version of her magic yet? Probably not. It absorbs that... all spells except its one weakness. And what is its one weakness? Okay, Kamari, you get out here too, then. Because currently you are the only one that can actually... Okay, you're good. Don't kill. God dang it. Orin, you can attack it. Okay, so he finally got Warrior. That's good. The opposite one is Thunder, is it not? Unless this thing is considered an ice enemy, meaning maybe fire? I mean, I guess it's worth a shot. Oh, yeah, apparently this thing is considered some kind of... Oh... Okay, so it turned blue. Does that mean it's now technically water? Okay, um, who else do we have? Waka, you get out here. Maybe you could do a bit more damage than Kamari. No, you cannot. Frick, that was a bad idea. Oh! No, never mind. I was thinking maybe his attacks um, show what uh, what type he is, but that does not that does not uh, work that way. Oh wait, yeah, it does. Wait, because he was using Blizzard before. Now he's using Water. Duh. Okay. So yeah, now we can use Thunder on it, and it'll do pretty good damage. There we go. Now it's probably gonna do Elemental Shift. Yep. Green. Blue again. Does that mean it's Water, or is that just the animation? Because if that's just the animation, then we're going to be in trouble until we figure out... Okay, Thunder. So now it's uh, Thunder-type, so we need to use water against it. Okay, 
Uh, we're getting pretty low on health, by the way. I feel like I should get Yuna in to heal. Um. Yeah, Orin and Lulu are doing most of the damage. Let's get Yuna in here to heal. In fact... I can overdrive... If we summon Ixion, that is our uh, lightning one. Oh no, it is lightning now! Oh frick, I'm an idiot. Oh god dang it, I'm an idiot. Oh frick, I needed to use water against it now. Which we actually don't have a water Aeon, we have... Um, What is Valifor? Is that just a general Aeon? Maybe Makalani is going to give us some water uh, Aeon? I don't know. Well, I can't do... Um, uh, I can't do either of these, because these are going to heal it. Magic. God dang it. Yeah, I'm just going to have to uh, just straight up attack it, I guess. God dang it. I'm a freaking moron, man. Why did I do this? Yeah, see, thunder. At least it's not able to attack us with the thunder. Does it only do elemental shift after you hit it with magic? Sorry about that, I had to move my uh, headset. Does it only do elemental shift after you hit it with magic, or after it takes enough damage? It must be after the magic, because I feel like we've done enough damage to it for it to, uh, uh, for it to shift. Yeah, 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 come on. I hate how it gets two turns. But we don't. Like, thunder and then slam. And then we just get attack. And then thunder, slam. And then attack. On the bright side, it really can't hurt us because every time... Oh, press. That's a new one. Huh. Because every time it tries to attack us with thunder, it heals us. So, unfortunately, not enough. Ow. God dang it, man. Don't kill me! Yeah, 10.51. Yeah, so it is slowly but surely killing me because it's hitting all of its slams, or all of its, um, presses now, or whatever you want to call those. This one right here. God dang it, why did I have to summon this god dang it thing? Ugh. Yeah, cause, um... Valifor is some kind of flying Aeon, which there really isn't any kind of a uh, air magic that I'm aware of. And then Ifrit is fire. Ixion is, uh, thunder. So we're missing water and, uh, ice. And I don't believe um, Valfor is either of those. So, yeah. Come on. Yeah, it's very, very slowly killing me. Because it hits me for just enough damage to take away the damage that it um, restored to me. God, this is going to be the most... Oh! Okay. This is gonna be probably the most infuriating, uh, <laughs> back and forth battle ever. Oh, actually. Wow, okay. I was gonna say it's probably gonna end there. Oh, no, there we go. Killed it. Woohoo! <laughs> oh, that was awful. That was completely awful. 
I am the worst at everything I do. Oh dear. Hey look, another sphere! Sweet. Oh! Okay. Weird. Seven 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 six four six. <laughs> oh, that is beautiful. I love that so much. Whoa, this is old. Don't know if you can play it back. Yeah, I probably will. Jacked left it here ten years ago. <sighs> play it back. Mm hmm. What are you taking? Well, you said it was gonna be a long trip. We'll be seeing a lot of neat things, right? So I thought I'd record it all in this. To show to my wife and kid, you know. This is no pleasure cruise. Hey, Braska. Ain't this supposed to be a grand occasion? Wait. They're in Cur they're they're in Zanakin from the past. As in Braska was in the past. Okay, I, I'm... I'm gonna shut up now because hopefully we'll find out what's going on, but oh my god. First of all, they're in the past, including Braska. Secondly, Orin is so freaking young, oh my god. We're the cheering fans, the crying women. This is it. Too many goodbyes. People think twice about leaving. If you say so. Well, it better be a lot more colorful when we come back. A parade for Braska, vanquisher of sin! <laughs> we should go. Day will break soon. Oren, could you stand closer to him? Good. That should do it. What's the matter? Afraid I might bite. Jacked. Braska, you should take one too. It'll make a great gift for little Yuna. I suppose. Lord Braska, we shouldn't be wasting our time like this. What's the hurry, man? Ugh. Let me tell you what the hurry is. Oren. What's the point? He wasn't on some pleasure cruise. Okay, first thing I got... Okay, an another little thing I gotta say. I really like that uh, that trio. Braska, Jekt, and Oren. They all just seem like a bunch of bros hanging out, trying to do something great. I love them. They, they look so great. I think there's more. Hey. If you're sitting there watching this... It means you are stuck in Spira like me. You might not know when you'll get back home, but you better not be crying. Although I guess I'd understand, but you know what? There's a time when you have to stop crying and move on. You'll be fine. Remember, you're my son. And, well, ah. Uh, 
Never mind, I'm no good at these things. Anyways, I believe in you. Be good. Goodbye. He sounded almost serious, but it was too late. He was serious. Jacked had already accepted his fate. His fate? Jacked, he... He was always talking about going home to Xanarkand. That's why he took all those pictures, to show them to you when he returned. But as he journeyed with us, and came to understand Spira, and Braska's resolve. It happened gradually, but Jekt changed. He decided he would join Braska in his fight against Sin. So then, he gave up going home? That was his decision. I guess I understood. My old man, he knew there was no way back home, back to Xanarkand. He wanted to go home, but he knew he couldn't. He couldn't go on until he accepted it. Besides, even if he had found a way back, I don't think he would have left his friends behind before their journey was complete. All right, let's go, guys. Maybe I had to start accepting my own fate. Jex Fears, Fears that document Jex's journey are hidden all over Spira. Defeating the Spheromorph has unlocked the seals that once bound the Spheres. Find them. Interesting! Does that mean back uh, as well? Or in Learn Shooting Star? Interesting. I suppose uh, we can't really go back in the game to find more, so I suppose it's really only forward. So I guess we have to search every nook and cranny to try and find more of his fears as we go along then. Interesting, okay. I don't really think there's any other spheres hidden here. I'm just looking for any other treasure, really. No? Wait. Okay. Yeah? Jack loved you. Oh, come on, please. He just didn't know how to express it, he said. Enough about my old man, okay? I think deep I down thought you should know. I think deep down Titus okay. does know that though. He may Thanks. not want to uh to actually explicitly say it, but I think deep down Titus knows that Jack loved him. Especially after being trapped in uh spear here. Okay, so real quick, let me save and heal for that matter. Uh, save here, yes, there we go. I should also go, uh, back onto my, uh, other play file there. I think it's, oh, pick up play file 2 or something like that. Um, to see if we can, uh, read any more Albed stuff from the past. Really, Grim? Don't play with that. Oh, another travel agency. Oh, wait, this is the, uh, the one... Oh! And there's a book here. Nice. I will take that. Speaking of Albed, nice. What brings you here? Rim, for taking up a place like this? What? He'll be rich by tomorrow, all on account of this celebration. Ah. Uh. Hmm? What? Great! I'm... I mean, I could try buying from you, but I literally just looked, and yeah, you don't have anything I need. Sorry. Wait, what the? I can encounter things here? That's weird. Um, okay, I'm gonna switch out to Titus. I actually will try and fight these things simply because I am kind of low-ish. Uh, okay, so you're obviously Blizzard, so I'm gonna use fire. Fire! Haha! <laughs> 666. I love it. Uh, let's see, you can attack that one and probably kill it. Oh, or not. You could probably miss it. Okay, 
Okay, actually, which one of you is going to attack first? You are actually going to attack first, so I will attack you. Then I will fire you again. In other words, you fire. And, Oren, I swear to god you better actually be able to attack this. Jesus Christ! Oren, I'm leaving- actually, you're probably not even gonna have a- Nice one. Oren's probably not even gonna have a chance to fight this. Because it is now dead. Nice one, Oren. You are a disgrace. And Titus is dead. Nice one. <sighs> so what's up with you? Hi there. Would you look at this? They always leave me behind. <laughs> Oh, you want me to scratch you? Ah, uh, scratches! There, good boy. <laughs> How'd you know what it wanted? Uh, I've always been able to tell how chocobos feel. Maybe I'd make a better chocobo breeder than chocobo knight, huh? <laughs> hey, what job do you see me doing? Um... I mean, he said to himself that he feels like he would probably be a better breeder, but I feel like by saying this, it would kind of be insulting, like, oh yeah, you're a terrible knight, but you could be a good breeder. And be like, oh, I'm a terrible knight, oh, okay. But if I say a knight, then I'd be like, yeah, I guess. I never wanted to be a breeder anyway. I don't know, I'm, I'm gonna say breeder. Yeah, I think so too. Awesome, he didn't take it the hmm. wrong way. You know, I might just give it a try. If you do what you love as a job, you'll never work a day in your life. Or however that phrase goes. That's why I try and do YouTube! Hello? Oh, this is one of these spheres, gotcha. Never mind, it don't matter. Alright, so! I learned last episode that apparently talking to different people gains them different affection values in the game. And whoever you talk to first gets, um... Uh, affection values as opposed to everyone else. Um, so essentially, if I were to talk to Orin, he would get more affection values. If I were to talk to Waka, he would get more. If I were to talk to Yuna, she would get more, etc, etc. Who do I think would deserve more? I don't know what those affection values actually affect. No pun intended. Uh, like, I'm not sure if you can actually start a relationship you know, at the end of the game, like, different endings or something like that. Um. Hmm. Yo, what's up, Riku? Can we go now? I'm tired of waiting. Sorry. Lulu, what's Yuna's up? Yuna's really quiet. Yeah, that, that would happen. Seriously. A wedding's not supposed to make people feel this bad. Come on, don't say that. Ah, <laughs> uh, I say that wrong. I want. Ever since I was a kid. Oh, <laughs> so you're an adult now? I mean, he is 23. Really? Anything can happen. Make sure you're prepared. Right? Mm -hmm. I don't think I can even... Oh, I can. Temple not far. Wise. I don't know. Why do we stop here? I've heard Lady Yuna is to wed Mace. Jesus Christ. It is great news. I'd like to... But it... I'd hoped Lady Yuna would defeat Sin. Yuna's still gonna journey. Ah, that is also... Mm -hmm. Whatever. Um, one sec. Uh, you know what? Let's, let's see if we can buy any weapons. Uh, let's see. Ch -ch 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 -ch. Uh, we already have a variable mog. We already have one of them. We already have one of them. Oh, wait. Oh. Actually, if I get this and add defense onto it, it would be better. Let's do that instead. Yes. Let's see. That one wouldn't help. Uh, I could actually get this and add defense to it. No, actually, that's good. I can 
potentially add Berserk Ward. I don't know if I actually have the means for it. So actually, let's um, yeah, okay. Let's try and fiddle around with customize real quick and see if I could do anything. Let's see. Yeah, so I can do something else with that. Are all the new ones we bought down at the bottom? I think they are. Yeah, they are. Okay. Actually, now that I think of it, I don't know why I bought this one. Oh, well. Dang it, I wish I could see what our current, uh, equipped ones were. Can I... Hold on a sec. Let me see if I can, um... No items. Equipment. Auto. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I know we're going a little over on time for this episode, but... Oh well. Okay, so... We don't have anything else here. Currently, we have the Seeker's Shield on here. Um... Oh yeah, because I was gonna upgrade this one with defense. Or try to add defense. Let's see... I can only do plus three defense, though. And that'll get rid of some power spheres. What does this one have? Um, oh, that is plus three. Okay, so yeah, that actually would help. I would be getting rid of a couple spheres, but I mean, that's not too terrible of a thing, I guess. Graham, can you not climb up there, please? That would be very helpful. <sighs> I literally cannot see anything, because Grim is in front of my TV. Can you move? I love you. Can you move, please? Ah, thank you. Okay, there we go. Okay, so... That one's good, then. Rod of Wisdom... No. Okay, yeah, that's not helpful. Currently, she has this on here. What other rings does she have? No, okay. Shimmering Blade. Yeah, we can add something else onto here. What else could we do? Sensor... Um, oh, these are things that we don't actually have, I see. Oh, wait, maybe not. Not enough items. Do we not have four chocobo feathers? That's kind of weird. I thought we did. Hmm. Oh, well. Not that I wanted to actually add that on there, but whatever. Okay, so... Piercing, strength... can add more strength onto it. Magic. I feel like strength would probably be the best, actually. Yeah. Okay. Spring Bracer. Yeah, I was gonna add... Actually. Berserk Ward really wouldn't help too much for him. What else can I add to this? Defense, magic defense, potentially. I feel like he's relatively weak against magic. Now yeah, let's do it, I guess. Why not? Okay, so... No, he's good there, I think. Oh, wait, no, no, wait. Magic, strength, piercing, piercing, strength. Right, for this one I was going to add more strength to it, because that's what Kamari needs, pretty much. Yes. Okay, uh, for the switch hitter... Um, actually, I feel like strength and strength would probably be good. I don't know why I have another one. Oh well. Okay, so you have HP 10 plus. Oh. Huh. I can add, like, HP and defense onto here, couldn't I? Uh, it would only 
be plus 5 HP though. Hmm. Yeah, let's just add general defense, I guess. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so you have nothing really. Yeah, okay. Right, Devastator. You are relatively weak, so I'm gonna add more defense? Oh, wait, no, this is a weapon, so I'm gonna add more strength to you. Yes. Uh, let's see. And... I'm gonna add lightning ward to this. There we go. Basically to make an upgraded, um, yellow targe. Because if I were to try and add health to this, it would only do plus three or plus five. Yeah, plus five. Okay. So now let's quickly equip everyone with all their new stuff. If I gave them anything new. Nope, okay. Good. Uh, I think I did this one for him, right? Yeah. Yep. Oh. Oh, yeah, okay. Let's see. Metal shield, metal shield. Yeah, that's when I did. Okay, good. Let's see. Magic, strength, piercing. Yeah, I did strength, uh, piercing, and strength. Uh, oh, no, oh, dang it. Oh, frick. Strain armlet. I guess. Switch hitter. Yeah, I'm not sure why I got two of them, but whatever. Yeah, I'll do that one. God dang it, why do I keep doing that? Okay, Devastator. Yep, you're good. Yellow Targe. I'm gonna give you the better Yellow Targe. I'm keeping the uh, the Lightning Ward just simply because she is terrified of Lightning. I don't know, I just feel like it works with her character. So. Not that it really matters at all, but I don't know. Okay, so I think we're all good then. I'm gonna sell everything that's unnecessary. I do apologize I am going so far over on time here, but what can you do, right? Okay, so I can sell this one, I can sell this one, I can, yeah, I can sell this one. I'm not going to sell the buckler, because that's his original one. Conductor, I'm going to sell. Um, I'm going to keep that one, because I still feel like I might need it. Moon ring we got for the uh, 10,000 gil, I think it was. So I'm going to keep that one, just in case it's important. Let's see, Bracer, that's a good one. I'm gonna sell this one. Sell that one. I still feel like I accidentally sold his original, um, uh, thing. Unless maybe that was the Hunter Spear? I don't know. It's definitely not Detector. I know that much. It's not Forest Lance. Yeah, yep. First goal? I feel like that one's important. I'm not gonna sell that one. I'm also gonna sell the... I'm gonna keep that in case I do actually find something else I can add to it. Okay, defense. Uh, yeah, this one's a little bit less defense, but better health overall. Um, sleep touch, yeah, that's not really that good. Angle that's a normal claw. Yep, there we go. Alright. Done here. Thank you. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, items. Equipment. Oh dear. Auto sort. There we go. And now we're all good. Okay, so I'm gonna save. Do, do, do. It was on this one. Yes. Alright. So, in between episodes, I'm gonna try and uh, actually use all of our uh, level points there that we got. And, um... Yeah, quickly do that, because that shouldn't take more than, like, 10, 20 minutes, something like that. And then, uh, yeah, next episode, I guess we'll continue. Hopefully we're not going to battle anything too terribly annoying, because, um, yeah, we're probably still not entirely equipped. So, yeah, anyway, if you guys did enjoy this episode, then please leave a like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Thank you, and have a great day, then. Goodbye.